we're looking to prove that for all natural numbers n 2 divides n squared plus n so that is that n squared plus n is even um, so the notation I've introduced here is that p of n means that this statement this statement that 2 divides n squared plus n is true so that's what we're trying to prove and this notation helps with the, uh, the logic of the proof later on so we're going to start with our base case which is we're going to consider p1 and we're going to check if p1 is true so we'll do that here so p1 that means we've got n equals 1 so we're going to check what the value of n squared plus n is when n equals 1 and that is 1 squared plus 1 which is 1 plus 1 which is 2 and we know that 2 divides 2 obviously so p1 is true that's good that's a good start now what we do uh, for, so that's our base case now what we do is something called an anchor step and for the anchor we essentially we assume uh, for some k in the natural numbers that p of k uh, holds so that is we've assumed that 2 divides k squared plus k for some k so not not necessarily for all of them all in uh, natural numbers but for some natural number we're assuming that this is true um, and then what we're going to try and show now in our induction step is that so we want to show that p of k implies p of k plus 1 so we're going to consider the case when n equals k plus 1 so that is k plus 1 squared plus k plus 1 which is equal to k squared plus 2k plus 1 plus k plus 1 which is equal to k squared plus 3k plus 2 now we want to rearrange this into a form so that we can use the fact that p of k is true um, to show that p of k plus 1 is true so we can write this as k squared plus k and then what we have left is plus 2 k plus 1. You should expand this out and just check that those two things are the same. And this here divides 2, uh, 2 divides this, sorry. Um, and that's that's from p of k. And this bit clearly divides 2 because it's 2 multiplied by some natural number. So we've got the sum of two things that are uh, multiples of 2 um, divisible by 2. Uh, therefore this whole thing is divisible by 2 so in this step we've shown that p of k does indeed imply p of k plus 1 and then we know that p of 1 is true so that gives us that p of 2 is true, p of 3 is true, p of 4 is true and and so on um, so we've proved that for all n in the, for all n in the natural numbers this statement, P of N, holds true.